Tonight, local radio operators are working to ensure our community is prepared for disaster. They're readying for the worst if it should come, a massive loss of power, cell phone reception, or internet services. KCBD News Channel 11's Parker Schaffner tells us about the effort and how you can join. An update can take down systems all over the country. Um, you know, we have no warning. That's why West Texas Pathfinders is promoting the importance of radio. It comes as the world continues to move forward with digital technology. Brandon Kimbrell believes it has proven unreliable. If, if we lose power, we're probably going to be in the dark. And, uh, and if you don't have something that's battery powered or something you can power yourself, you're, you're probably just going to be limited to voice. The General Mobile Radio Service Network is working to ensure that never happens. It provides our communities with self-reliant communications, especially in an emergency. If somebody needed to get a hold of somebody, a relative in California, we could pass a message to that person and get a reply back. Supplementing the GMRS with these emergency communications allow us to do a whole lot more for the community. Kimbrell believes this would take pressure off of emergency management so it can focus on more important tasks at hand. If the community can help themselves, they don't need support. It's a service Kimbrell wanted in our community for two decades. Since its inception three years ago, membership has grown into the hundreds. He believes it's more valuable with every new volunteer. It's the people that make the radio uh, valuable. Having a network of people, just like a cell phone, a cell phone's a very poor radio, but what makes it powerful is that it's connected to everybody. You can get a GMRS license for less than $40. The group hosts an emergency net every Monday night at 7 on Repeater Channel 20. Parker Schaffner, KCBD News Channel 11.